Hey guys, I'm back. I know it's been so long since I did a vlog, but I actually found the time and had the house had the house to myself finally. So, what's been going on lately? Well, my hockey team didn't do as well as I'd hoped. They made it to the semifinals. Yeah, it sucks they didn't make it all the way, but they had a well hard battle and I'm so proud of them. Like, I'm happy that they won here before they went to the championships. They are or were the defending champions. And at the game, I was like crying because all the like most of the guys were in tears. I feel so bad, guys. If any of you are watching this, I am so sorry. But I have been a fan since I was a year old. I was going through the hockey games at a year old, which probably wasn't the best idea. But so much has been going on. Grads a few months away. I finally got my dress. Uh, sorry for my hands, I just had to keep switching. But, yeah, got my shirt from yesterday, from last night at the game, and got it for cheap. Um, yeah, things have been rough because of my family and, like, in school, everything's so last minute, everything's trying to get crammed in. But, uh, it's been a while, I feel so bad for what's been going, hasn't been, I haven't been vlogging much. It was 19 in January. So here in Canada, or in Saskatchewan, I'm finally legal to drink at the bars, which is so exciting. But, oh, excuse my laptop, you can hear it, I'm listening to music for a little bit. I'm waiting for my friend to come back because I'm waiting to go see him. It's been so long, and it's Easter break right now, so I'm so excited to see my friends. But, like, what else can I say? It's like it's only April right now like hopefully I'll be doing a lot more vlogging I apologize that I haven't done anything since I think November according to my channel by the way go check it out but like I want to do more now that I have more time but I feel like I'm not like your other typical youtubers like I'm vlogging like like once every couple months like I need to get back into it but I feel so bad for the guys, for my hockey team. Like, I couldn't be more proud of them. I went to the game. I made the right decision because I was scared to death that if I didn't go and they lost, I wouldn't forgive myself because I am friends or I know a couple of the guys on the team. So I was heartbroken to see them all in tears. But at least, again, they lost here and they had the home, I guess, home ice crowd with them rather than going to the other team which was Estevan at the time, and losing there, and then they have no, like, they didn't have the home crowd with them. I think it was more special to them to lose here. Well, losing is never good, but for this particular circumstance. But I know I need to get back into vlogging. I'm so sorry for rambling on, but I've been wanting to do a couple covers. My friend is a big fan of my singing, apparently, so I want to get back into that. And though I've only done like two covers, I think three maybe, and I've deleted them all because I hate my voice, but I've, well, people others seem to like it. But yeah, guys, this is, I know I haven't been on very much, and I do apologize for that. I need to get back into this. But there's nothing really much I can say right now. I'm hoping to do more covers and hopefully do more vlogging now that I have, hopefully have more time now that hockey season's over. But the rodeo's a few months away. I can't believe it's been two years now since I did the Rodeo Queen competition here. It's crazy because that means I broke my leg two years ago because I broke my leg, or I broke my knee in like three months after it happened, after the rodeo. So it's crazy to think that I'm in this position again. But this is my life right now. I feel bad again for the team because they didn't get as far as they'd hoped, especially for the guys that are leaving or they're aging out. But I know they'll do well no matter what happens. I'm excited for next year. Hopefully they can come back and like get that win again. Because in the SJHL, the Saskatchewan Junior Hockey League, the Canelta Cup is everything. It's like the Stanley Cup of the NHL basically, except not as big obviously. <laughs> But anyways, I am so proud of the guys. Again, if you, any of you guys are watching this, I'm so proud of you. There's nothing more we could have asked from you. You guys have given up so much for us, us fans, and we, we 
Like, we couldn't be more happy. You guys have come so far. You have nothing to be ashamed of. But my life has been tough because my friends haven't been all there for me. See, I got this tattoo, the two paws there, for my two friends because with all my cutting and stuff, they're like my guardian angels or they're my protectors. But right after I got this, one of my friends turned on me, which hurt me deeply. But one of them has been going through a rough time and he is my brother now. Like, we have been friends for so long and he is a guy that you just can't like leave. He is a guy that just like melts your heart every time you're with him, gives you a smile anytime you need it. But I gotta go finish getting ready so I'll maybe do another one later, maybe not, but love you guys so much.